Hello friends, today I am going to discuss about how to create and drop index in Cassandra. So add here, this is the NoSQL Manager for Cassandra and this all are key spaces. Now here after I am going to open. So add here Cassandra minus F. So by using this command, so add here Cassandra that has started. Now here after let's open command prompt once again. And here let's write CQLSH. CQ L S H. Now press enter. So that by using this command, so add here directory change, it comes under CQLSH. Now here after I'm going to create the tables first. So add here create table. Now copy and paste here. So add here create table S point. So S point is the key space and here EMP is the table. And here ID it is a tag name text tab and here that is state primary key and here ct text so if i press enter so uh, add here there is no any problems so that means add here table emp created on site as point so add here if you click there so emp is not there so let's repress as point now here you can see emp so if i double click on emp here you can see indexes so add here since i have set primary key on name so there is a one or key index that is created and here on column name now here after the next is going to insert some record inside emp table so let's copy that one and here paste press enter so add here why i'm getting invalid to oh emp okay i we need to use add here use as point okay s point is the key space now here after paste again so add here this time there is no any error now here after let's use add here select add here id column and id city and name now here after let's use so this time add here four rows inserted okay now here after i'm going to do the filtering Okay, select a star from and here uh, a star that to uh, uh, takes all the columns from uh, EMP. Now here after going to use now press enter. So this time add here I'm getting the error message. Select a star from EMP where ID. So ID is not a primary key and it has no uh, stated any indexes. So that here I'm getting the message. So you can treat invalid request. And here cannot execute this invoking filtering thus unpredictable performance. If you want to execute this query despite performance, so use allow filtering. So we can use allow filtering. So right here it's not filtering because ID column has not set with primary key or no any indexes. So that I'm going to create the index on ID. So add here, let's uh, create the index here. This is the syntax, create index, index name on key space table and here columns. So add here, create index, giving the name idx on s point is the key space on emp table and here id going to set with id. Now here after let's uh, paste add here, press enter. So add here, uh, no any error. That means index is created. Now here you can, or if I refresh as point, so it's refreshed. Now here after you can see idx, that is index. Idx is the name of index created on the column id. Now here after the next or thing is, so now here after I'm going to use this or query once again. So let's ask the add here. So copy and here you can just paste and press enter. So this time add here or record filter. So add here ID 115 and here city and name according to that it's a display. So it's a add here or filter filter the record because add here I just set index on the ID column. So if you do add here set index add here on ID column so it's a very easy you can filter. So add here to filter any records on the column 
is two condition and your first the column has primary key or you can set the index so if you set index then you can filter the columns records now hereafter so this is the simplest way we can create the index so and here only you need, need to read need to write at your create index here give the index name and here on s point is the key space and here emp and here specify the column name now hereafter to drop the index so okay let's copy and here paste now at this point and here paste so at here drop index if it checks it checks exits and here s point and here ids is the index name now hereafter if i do select a start from id so again the error message because id not set with any id has no any index at here so this is the things so that's why we are using at here or we are creating the index to filter the records and here after the next thing is let's go to add here no is called Cassandra manager now here after if you or do filter so add here here you can see add here or uh, idx or uh, no more at this point now here after i'm going to create the index add here so add here emp right click on emp here after here you can find so not this one okay let's right click here you can see right click on emp generate here create index click here now here you can see create index and here this give the name so add here new index is the name you can give add here new ind and which columns so add here there are so many columns three columns are there so let's write add here select select from and here going to select emp all field now here after emp now if i execute to this query so add here id city name so going to give add here id okay now here after create index now execute this query so add here index is created now here after double click so we need to refresh okay let's refresh here now here new id index created on the id columns now here index is created now here after you can use add here now here this time record is filter now here after i'm going to draw index once again draw and here the index name name and here id so let's just check the index name first new i and d new i and d so no any error now here after do one thing let's press key space so add here refresh so new underscore id is still has new new underscore i and d that's why it is still there now press enter now here after let's refresh once again so this time index is normal